Well, you know, we didn't plan to play with them. We tried to, our goal tonight was obviously to uh, get the lead and continue to push it. Um, they're a very good team and, and played extremely hard. Um, we competed, we battled, but they had that extra step there tonight. And, and uh, it's not a matter of, of wanting to or having more urgency or more desire in their game than our guys had. I mean, our guys, I mean, you see them in the dressing room right now, the tears that are being shed and how they feel and, you know, the energy of this crowd here tonight, how people support our Bronco hockey program. And as I was telling them, the reason they support it and are so energetic and for our team is because of how hard you guys work and you compete. And we, we battle till the end, but um, we weren't at our best here tonight and Colorado College was. They did the thing. We took a couple of penalties. Uh, obviously, they got the one power play goal and, you know, we had a shift that in our defensive zone that was just not very good defensively, and they took advantage to get the 2-1, and then they went a face-off, and uh, we failed to block a shot at the point, and they get it through, and guy tips it, and we don't have our man, and they put it behind us. But, uh, you know, uh, to me, th this is a tough loss, and we're all going to feel it more than anything. The, this just the energy in the building here tonight. I mean, unbelievable crowd, and that's, we're disappointed for that. I mean, and there's a, the sense of letting these people down that support our program so much. But on the other side of it, we've got four guys that um, are leaving our program, graduating seniors, and Trevor Gorsuch, and um, you know, uh, Cole Conrad, um, uh, Jade McMullen, and Corey Schooneman, and. The maturity that these guys have achieved over the four years, the successes they've enjoyed with our program, and obviously we haven't uh, won an NCHC championship, and uh, we haven't won a, a national championship, um, but we've got guys that have learned how to compete in battle. There's a sign that out here that says that tradition continues, and the tradition will contribute, and the contribution that they made here over their four years will continue to be recognized. And, We'll continue to strive to get better. I told our coaches we have a meeting first thing tomorrow morning. We'll meet with our seniors and talk about their future plans here now. We've got some guys that you know, are, are probably going to play, go and play pro right away in our graduating class because they've got the credits where they can, they can do that. And the other guys uh, will meet on, uh, what's today, Monday. We'll meet on Wednesday and discuss our plans for the offseason and how we can get better. Um, but uh, a very, very... Very disappointing. You feel for the players, obviously, and uh, we get to stand behind them and watch how hard they work all day. We get to see how hard they work every single practice. And, um, you know, the Bronco Hockey Nation appreciates the effort that our players put in on a nightly basis. Yeah, I mean, I think Trevor, uh, I mean, he's a success story. Um, you know, it's all about determination and hard work. And he was a guy that probably on the rating scale came in as our third goalie to start the season and uh, became the guy that on that 10 game stretch there that propelled us into the situation where we could play three extra games at home this year in front of our fans and uh, yeah a great story I mean it, you know certainly he made some saves I think at the other end of the ice um, we failed to hit the net again tonight last night uh, our shots were on net and and we were uh, there for rebounds and here tonight it was difficult to get those extra chance opportunities because we missed the net too much we were shooting for top corners from the outside which uh, if you're watching the team and you watch them tonight, you say, well, what are they doing? You know, what's the coach telling them? And obviously, I didn't tell them enough because we, we missed the net way too much. Important game. Um, big, big win for the Colorado program. Uh, they've been trying to get to, to St. Paul, and, you know, we're deeply disappointed that we're not the team going there. I mean, that was our plan at the beginning of the year was to get home ice in the playoffs. It was to go to St. Paul and do some damage there. And, and then move on into the NCAA tournament. But our, our season ends here.